the furthest I can remember in my life was when I was five years old. I remember standing at my mother's veranda. We grew up in a very rural, a remote place. It's a very rural area in a place in Zimbabwe. And I can tell you that I stood on that veranda and I looked before me and I saw a huge mountain. I saw a huge mountain, I saw trees, I saw a lot of things that were before me. And I remember dreaming that I was going to stand before a lot of people and I was going to be addressing people. I don't know where that dream had ever come from because I had never ever been in a place where somebody is addressing people. But I knew that was my dream. Today we are here and we are talking about your dreams and how to execute the dreams. My name is Vimbai. I am that lady that you can trust. So let me talk to you through the steps of uh, embarking on your dream and exec executing your dream. Number one, you need to realize that there are risks that you need to take before you embark on your dream. You need to understand that these risks are there and they are not going to go. So you have to be able to be that person that takes risks. Number two, you need to understand that fear will come and attack you. You will feel the fear, you will experience the fear, Fear will overtake you, but it is your choice, your choice to make in regards to whether you want fear to overtake you and to ruin your dream, or you want to overtake the fear and overcome the fear and move on and begin that step of taking the risk towards your dream. I'll tell you the number three that I'm going to talk to you about today. You are going to fall. You are definitely going to fall. You are going to fail at some point. But I can tell you today that if you do not fail in life, then it means you haven't taken a step forward. Every time you fail, always tell yourself that this is a step to, 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 to my dream. I have got to fail. Everybody failed before they got to their successful dream or they got to their end, end game of what they wanted to do. Why do you think you won't fail? Be ready to fail at a certain point. But when you fail, be ready again to come to a point where you start or start again. You begin, you continue with, 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 with the execution towards your dream. Now, the other thing that you need to understand the, the step towards your dream is that you need to believe in yourself. You need to believe. You need to have faith. If you do not have faith, that dream will not come to pass. I remember I can tell you that every time I am stuck and I am talking to my mother, she says, so what are you going to do? Then my answer is always, don't worry, something will give. Because I always believe in things that I have not seen. But because I know it is my dream and I know I'm executing and I, am, I know I'm taking the risk and I, am, I know I, am, I, I overca I've overcame the fear and I know that I will fail at some point, but I will not let failure stop me from getting to my dream consistency again is something that you need to hold on to you need to be consistent to continue going and to, because you know that at the end you're going to you're going to get what you want I remember I can tell you that there are so many things that I have gone through I have gone through me going taking a car off finance and the car getting repossessed I remember sleeping in a car, I can tell you, I was so in love <laughs> with my first love. We would sleep in a car because we were embarking on a certain dream that he had. And we had to sleep in a car and of course, yes, I was supporting him. But it was also my dream. And I slept in a car when, 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 when things get, got tough. I can tell you that I moved from owning cars, owning, I've owned over nine cars in my life and I've come back to a point where I own none, zero, and I'm walking again. So I can tell you that it is because of consistency and it is because I believe and it is because I take risks and it is because I know that there is a dream, there is a dream that I'm chasing. But the execution does not only come with strategy. It comes with the above or the, 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 the points that I have given you where you are going to fail, where you are going to fear, where you have to take the risk and where you have to endure. Consistency comes with endurance. You need to endure. You need to stand on what you believe in. And I can tell you that there are going to be people that will come and pull you down in the route or in the road to your dream. And they will come and say, oh, you're crazy. No, you're mad. Why are you doing all that? 
Why are you taking all those risks? Don't you know that you've got to calculate risk? Don't you know that you've got to understand that if there is something, a sixth sense that is making you scared? No, it is because they don't know how to chase their dream. But if you embark on chasing your dream, you will get to your dream. Thank you. Please do like and subscribe my YouTube channel and any booking references, any booking details are on the screen. Thank you so much. We're going to talk more and more about this situation. We'll talk about health. We'll talk about making decisions. We'll talk about falling in love. We'll talk about choices, choices that, that affect your success and your dreams and the place where you need to get to in life remember whenever you were created you were created for a purpose and that purpose is your dream and the dream can only be um, uh, can only be made possible by you and your execution thank you very much diabulela <laughs>